Now, so far we have enjoyed quite a lot. Now, let's uh, work on how we can uh, access camera or let's say image gallery in this video, right? This will be more fun stuff, right? Okay, so let's do it. So for that, we will be using this Expo Image Picker package and we need to install it. So just copy this command expo install expo image picker control c and just go to your terminal and hit enter and uh, hit just right click and hit enter so so let's wait for a few moments and let this package install for, so we can minimize that and when uh, now what we can do is we can just read little bit documentation so we need to import everything and rename it as image picker so we'll copy this line okay and let's see if there are some examples or not okay so we need to grab permissions as well and i think we need to ask for the permission first okay it is asking to access camera roll okay yeah and it's easy to do. okay so let's first copy these two lines uh, image picker and expo permissions control c right and let's see if our package is installed okay so this package is installed so let's open our vs code so i have opened this create employee component and just paste it here and we can just get rid of this constant so we are importing here everything and renaming it renaming it as image picker and we are importing everything and renaming it as uh, permissions from this expo permissions and from this expo image picker okay yeah so we need to install this package right but we we need not to install this package this is pre-installed okay so now let's work on let's create a function let's say const uh, pick uh, p i c k pick from let's say gallery g a w l e r y gallery okay now assign it to arrow function right like so and let's first we will uh, ask ask user for the permission now we can make this per, this function async as async and now we can use await inside in it await and here we can use permission p r m i permissions and then ask async right and this inside in an ask async we can again use permission p e r m i again p is capital permission dot when then we can ask for camera roll. i think for to access gallery uh, the name is camera roll and to access camera uh, we need to ask for camera i'm not sure though let's see now from here we can destructure something and that something is called i think granted if user grants us the permission then we can destructure g ah oh yeah this okay we get suggestion granted now granted is true if user gives us the permission right so if uh, granted uh, granted is true uh, sorry then we'll do something else we'll do something right okay now if uh, if user gives us the permission then we we need to open up the camera right so for that i think uh, we can just use await and oh sorry await and here we can use image picker yeah this one and here we can use dot and here we can use launch uh, image library or maybe uh, yeah image library async right i uh, will make a separate function to launch camera right awesome so image library takes us takes the object yeah so in this object we can write media types and that media types will be let's say image picker dot media uh, not like this uh, yeah media type options and from there we'll okay so we can upload videos as well but for now we'll just select images right okay now in second option let's give it a lot of editing yeah user will be able to crop images right so let's give it a true and here we can define aspect ratio so this aspect will be basically an array so here we can define ratio so what we will do we will we will allow user one is to one ratio so that our image will be perfect square or oh, not is two we just need to write here comma yeah okay perfect and the, now we can what we can do is uh, give is quality q u a l uh, q u q u a l i why it is not giving me session because i have forgot a comma here quality yeah quality and now the quality is between 0 to 1 so we, if you use here 1 so it will upload uh, the full quality image 
if so if we write here 0 0.5 it will reduce the quality to its half so yeah we can use this 0 0.5 right as well okay so to half the quality or you can use one as well right ah uh, not a big deal okay so if users takes the image from image gallery now this will return us something so for now let's create a variable and let's name it as data and for now let's console.log that data console.log that data okay now if user doesn't give us a permission then what we can do is we can just import alert from react native i think we have alert uh, just put a comma here a l e r o a l yeah this alert and when here we can just alert alert dot alert and here in alert we can just pass a uh, message like you need to give us p r m i l s i n permission permission to work right okay yeah so let's copy this function we'll do alt shift down key and let's rename it as pick from camera right here c a m e r a c m e r a camera and in here i think we can write permissions dot simply camera and here instead of launch image async we can use let's put a dot here and launch camera async like so yeah and this will also console.log that out and i think it's we should test this out so here instead yeah, where are our two buttons so here it is so let's call this when user clicks on the camera button now let's call our function that is from uh, pick from what was the name pick from let's say camera here and here let's say pick from gallery right awesome so now let's open our emulator so here is my emulator now let's run the app on emulator so we can hit npm run a n d r o i d right okay so let's wait for a few moments and i think it is opening on our device and let's uh, see the output and it is bundling the bundle i think it is finished so ah uh, okay ah uh, just wait we can't do anything we can just wait it ah uh, why it is taking so much time okay uh, we are getting error here already initialized root view what was that just hit reload again and there we go now let's create on this to navigate to our create employee screen now let's click on upload image right and here we can choose from the gallery so can't find variable test and let's see uh, i haven't saved this oh my bad okay so let's test this one more time uh, let's reload it hit reload now let's again navigate to create employee click on upload image let's select image from gallery okay it's asked for permission let's allow let's allow whatever it is asking so here uh, our gallery is open so now let's pick this image okay so it is uh, giving us option to crop and this and you can see we have one is to one aspect ratio so it is a perfect square we can crop it right and here we go we have uploaded it oh we haven't uploaded we have accessed the image and see you, in here in data our cons uh, our, we have logged the data and here in data we have a lot of things we have cancelled equal to false and we are here we have uri and in uri we have this image right this is jpg image right awesome amazing now let's now, so now let's test it out if we click in this camera here right let's allow uh let's see if our camera opens up so this is the default camera of the emulator i guess so uh let's click in here so I just closed my emulator because my PC was producing some kind of noise. So we'll test this camera thing in our real device. So I have opened up visor, right? So let me uh, run this app on my real device, right? Okay, so this is my app. So let's uh, press A to open this up on our real device and uh, get rid of this notification, 
right and yeah let's see create a plus click on plus here we can click on upload image and let's say if it opens up a camera okay it is asking for permission okay allow right and here we go it has opened camera for us okay so it has opened front camera so let's see how the pick goes and here we can press okay so too bad pick okay so too bad pick uh, i don't want my face what we can do just crop it up and let's see if we have logged on console something yeah so we have logged so this is the basically the image and yeah so this this objects is identical as we accessed from uh, our uh, gallery as well right so this is same as we got in our gallery as well right when we accessed image from gallery so yeah it was nice application right it was fun to do right so let's uh, work on how we can upload these images right in very next video so till then bye bye